Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Scorpios. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Scorpios. Have you been taking care of yourselves, eating plenty of fruit and vegetables, and taking care of that beautiful, sexy temple of yours, Scorpios, as it take care of you, my loves. Welcome back. Come on in. Have a seat. We're going to see what messages source your guardian angels and your ancestors have for you, for you today. And shout out to the beautiful Soul Family. Thank you so much, Soul Family. It is a pleasure and an honor to have each and every one of you all. Thank you so much for your continuous love and support. And welcome back, loves, to the ones that are new here. It is always a pleasure. I hear you. I see you all's comments. And thank you so much, Scorpios. I appreciate you. All right. So no further ado, Scorpios. Let's go ahead and dive in. We're going to see about the person here that's on your mind. We're going to see how they feel about you. What are their hidden feelings here? And then we're going to tap into some tarot here. See what's going on in tarot land about the person here that's on your mind. And then, of course, we're going to close out with my raw tarot famous index cards. Okay, so let's see how this person here feels, what they want to say, what's going on. Let's get some details for you, Scorpio. Wow. I hide behind material things, okay? So this person here may have hide or hid behind material things here and didn't take in consideration maybe his consequences or her consequences here. Uh, but whatever this is, this person now has regrets for even hiding behind maybe the things that they will purchase or hiding behind the way that they feel by purchasing something at the store, okay? And when they know... They may not need to have done that, okay? It's kind of like that type of energy here. But with you, they feel like, you know, they, uh, I don't know necessarily what their reason was for doing this, but I feel like whatever it was, it really caused a relationship here, Leo's, between you two to definitely be off balance here, okay? So let's go ahead and dive a little deeper. Let's now go into tarot. Let's see what else we don't figured out here and then what we can get out the raw tarot index cards here. Wow, the Knight of Pentacles here, Earth Elements here, Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo energy. Some of y'all, this particular energy here is someone that wants to set the intentions to take their time. They don't want you to be rushed. They don't want them to be rushed. They want everything to kind of go with the flow, but they do want to also bring you an offer as just a thanks for allowing them to come towards you. So some of y'all, you may have met this person before, of course, because this person hid behind things. But this person here is definitely wanting to come in and make amends, but not only come in with a wand or a cup here, but they want a, they want a solid opportunity with you, okay? This person wants to uh, grow with you, build with you, evolve with you, and that Knight of Pentacles energy here, okay? So let's see what else. Wow, we got the four pinnacles in reverse. So this is interesting. This tells me that this particular person or energy, they would love to move forward with you. All right. The energy that's over here that where it's coming out in reverse, this is energy here stating that you are all forward, Scorpios. You're looking forward to this new offer and this opportunity here that's coming in for you as well. You may have been feel like you've been waiting for this moment because you know that maybe it was always something still there between you and this person. This could be someone that you met at a distance, at a time frame where you wasn't in the best space at the time here. But now times do change. They definitely do bring about abundance and change and opportunity. And I feel like more and more and more that you be around this person here, Aries, the more you're going to see that here. Okay, wow, I'm loving the messages already getting deep. Okay, hit that like button, Scorpios, if it's resonating for you. Let's go ahead and dive a little deeper. Oh, yeah, look at that. We got the Queen of Wands, okay? So this person see you as their Queen of Wands, or they see you as an energy here that they would love to be able to 
put in motion with, okay? This person love how confident, how bold it you are in yourself, okay? And this is what they want, is what I'm picking up here, and they love that about you. I mean, this is a queen wanting to sit next to a king. So this is how your person is definitely feeling towards you. They're all about it with the Knight of Pentacles here, and so are you because you're not no longer holding back. I feel like some of you all was realizing that you may was holding back on this person, but as you two get to meet each other, you know what you want and what you're wanting to say to this person, okay? And it's obviously working here, okay? So let's see here, Gordon Angels. Thank you so much. All right, wow, okay. I, I mean, I don't blame them. I don't blame this person at all. Just coming from your reading here, this kind of makes sense. Look at that. We got, I'm not giving up and I like the way you treat me. Yeah, so this person enjoys and loves the way you treat them. All right, so definitely keep doing what it is you're doing because even within their working environment, it's like they have been trying to throw you off. So in your working environment, I hear in my working environment, so you may have an issue here within your working environment or your job here as well, all right? But people may be a little jealous because of how they see you treating this person or giving the attention and the time that you're giving to this person versus someone from the past. Now, that was random. That came out of their random, okay? But you definitely have someone that is not in the energy of ever having felt the way that you're allowing this person to feel here. Yeah, I can't make this up. Look at what came out here. Missing your lips, okay? And they can't stand you. Wow. I knew it. I knew there was some fuckery energy around some people that didn't deserve to be in your energy or this person's energy at the moment here. But this is what we have here. And this is definitely going to give you some clarity here, I feel like, Scorpio, on the next moves that you would like to take towards this person. Of course, this is someone that's very attractive. They get a lot of attention. So with having that uh, details there about this person and whoever that they were with in the past, it doesn't matter at the end of the day. As long as Scorpio happy, as long as Scorpio is not giving up on what he truly or what she truly wants, she's going to have that or he's just going to have just that. All right. Wow, Scorpios. Thank you so much. I really appreciate your love and support. And thank you for the ones that are new here. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I definitely look forward to the next love messages for you Scorpios. You all take care. Bye-bye.